The Fulton County Sheriff officially changed the name of a specialized crime fighting unit. The elite team went from Scorpion to Fast. As News Edge reporter Eric Perry tells us, the change comes after tough scrutiny on the Memphis unit following the beating death of Tyree Nichols. The name change here comes after five members of the Memphis Police Department's own Scorpion unit were charged in the death of Tyree Nichols. A nation was outraged after video surfaced of five Memphis police officers beating 29-year-old Tyree Nichols following a traffic stop in January. Memphis police disbanded its Scorpion unit after Nichols' death. Friday, Fulton County Sheriff Pat Labatt announced his department will change the name of its Scorpion unit to FAST. FAST stands for Fugitive Apprehension Support Team. Labatt says those Memphis police officers, quote, cast dishonor and suspicion on the unit title Scorpion. So what is this unit? The sheriff says its focus is to suppress crime, catch criminals, and reduce gang-related crimes. Cosmetic changes are good, but we need policy changes and legislative changes that hold law enforcement accountable so that the trust can be rebuilt. President of the Georgia State Conference NAACP Gerald Griggs says it's a step in the right direction. We need a strong and robust partnership uh, from law enforcement in calling for changes in Georgia's law to make it easier to hold police officers who violate the public trust accountable. Griggs says there's more that can and should be done. We need to make sure that Police officers are guardians and not warriors. Griggs believes that accountability is key. Uh, we also uh, believe that specialized units uh, should be rolled back and even disbanded. Uh, but this is a first, a good first step uh, to making sure that if there is a specialized fugitive unit, um, the name does not evoke some type of violent creature that could hurt the public. And the sheriff was not available for comment, but told us that the team will uphold the same mission and values as it did under the previous name. In Atlanta, I'm Eric Perry, Fox 5 News.